And we're back. And we are back. Okay, actually, I think this is only the second time we're playing Animal Crossing on stream, but whatever. I'm also trying to be quieter, because I think everyone else in my house is asleep. But we're back. It's not... Uh, you can see that I actually started this like five minutes ago and then went, ah, I shouldn't do this before I'm actually live. So, yeah. Also, hey, Miriam, and I think I see some other folks who are currently lurking, so I'm not going to call them out, but still, welcome all. Yes, today, oh, right, no, it's bunny day, not egg day, whatever, I thought it was egg day. Uh, it's the same thing. Yes, yes, of course, we, we might possibly have a special visitor. Hello, cat. Oh. But yeah, Miriam, that sounds like a good plan, honestly. I'm... I should have poked you on Friday, I'm sorry. I did not do anything on Friday. And then I didn't do anything yesterday for completely different reasons. Okay, does the Happy Home Academy actually- Yes! Yes, the Happy Home Academy actually likes my fucking house now because one room is covered in egg stuff. Oh, yeah, give me that whatever the hell your S rank is. Cherry Blossom Petals dance upon the wind like some kind of bizarre battalion of breeze ballerinas. Smile grace in my face as I watch the petals fall. All is well. And then sneeze. Sure, okay, what the hell are these? A bronze HSA, er, HHA. H H A plaque and a tissue box. Those are some of the weirdest items I've received in a while. Okay, so yes, the cherry blossom. Oh right, everyone is dressed up in the weird mono egg outfits. Hang on, I need to go do a thing before I forget. Um, which is to say, I need to open the island in case. Hey, cat butt, can I help you? Hello, stretchy boy. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, I want visitors. Online play. Hello, cat butt. Hello, you horrible pest. Hey, Sarah. You horrible, horrible pest. Yes, open the island. Also, Miriam, that sounds remarkably relaxing. I spent yesterday and so like I didn't stream Friday because I streamed way too long and way too late on Thursday and then yeah even once I finished that I ended up watching uh, Joe Kim play the Final Fantasy remake and then the day after and then yesterday we had the extra thing of um, our first, like, therapy session. What? No. The more the merrier. Yes. So I was just, like, emotionally drained after that one, too. The upside is... Yes, invite everyone. Good lord. Uh, the upside is that I did get to... We did take Friday to redo my hair, so it's less washed out now. Okay. The town code is LR... 7WS. Uh huh. Okay, I just want to make sure that I had the command set up for that. Okay, yeah, so that is set. Why did you wake up just to sit in my lap and be a horrible pest? You are such a lovely cat, but you're also such a pest. For a second, you thought Cap had a weird new scar somehow. Do you remember eye floaties? Oh, that would have been terrifying. I'll say, hey, Om, how you doing? Um, no, I think since you saw me, Sarah, we shaved the sides down a bit extra. Cause oh, here, uh, because they were like a three before, and now they're down to a two. Oh God, my. My stocks are 108 bells. Ugh. I don't want to drop 108 bells. 
per stock. Ooh. Nico's attacking your shawl and can't get free. That seems not great. Hey there, Skipper. It's me, Zipper, the terrifying hell beast. I'm the lucky yellow bunny. I'm here to say there's something super special happen hippity happening today. <laughs> Let's all clap. Any time now. You did, and we agreed. It's just that we it took us a bit to do it. Ooh, you're on 99? Ooh, yay. Okay. You're trying to figure out what the lure is with this game? Um, I love this game and I can't tell you what it is. I have no fucking idea. Why does the bunny have a cold dead stare? Because the that's not a bunny. It's someone in a bunny m outfit. If you can see his back, he's got a zipper. Do I remember you? Well, of course I do. I never forget a friendly face, especially when I meet in a new place. Also, everything he says rhymes. That's also why his name is Zipper. Looks like you kept my, my visit a secret. I'm surprised you actually listened. Anyway, my favorite day is finally here. Time to fill this island with bunny cheer. Hip hop hooray. Are you ready to celebrate bunny day? Great. Say it with me now. The time has come. Let's look for eggs. That's my bunny plan. They're here. They're here. Or they're here, they're there, they're everywhere. Find them if you can. Do you understand what I'm trying to say? I can still hunt for eggs on this special day. Yeah, you could use use your time wisely and try to find the six types of eggs hidden around the island. Why didn't that one rhyme? If you find all six types, they'll give you a funny bunny reward. You know what? I also have a surprise for some bunny very special. Oh god, what is this? And that some bunny is you! Here's a bunny day arch recipe. To say thank you, thanks for all you do. Well then, you better hop to it. Uh, hop to it if you're ready to f find each and every bunny DIY recipe you've hidden. I have a super extra special reward for anyone who crafts all my bunny day recipes. Hang on, I have to go get that. Uh, where'd it go? I hear it. I hear it. Where is it? Shit, where is it? Oh, is it up here? Yes, there it is. Hang on. Oh god, there's more of them. Don't be eggs. No, I don't need eggs. I need the... Are you gonna come this way? There we go. Damn it, I'm hoping for more recipes. <sighs> Miriam, that was terrible. But yeah, honestly, I, I love Animal Crossing, and I don't know why. I think it's just that sort of... Like... It does the same thing that mobile games do, where it just, it, it, it doesn't quite hit the Skinner box level of actually being a Skinner box, but, or without, like, it doesn't do, like, the bars and things, but then you also, then I also have to remember that, like, it's, it did that before mobile games were a thing, which is somehow more terrifying. Um. Oh god, by all of the Bunny Day DIY recipes, does he mean I have to make all of the clothes too? Because, here. Also, I love that you can sort by season. Uh, da -da -da -da. So, seasonal recipes, I've made everything. I've made everything except for the clothes, because the only clothes that I made were the these ones, that are like, combine everything that are like, not just one color. Hey, fan! Oh, wait, you're right. Suits can't blink. I'm more concerned about whatever the hell this thing is. I... I don't know if I can get you a good angle at the... Wait, hang on. If I talk to Zipper from here... Yeah, there. See? Giant Zipper down his back. Hey, excuse me, but could you please stop staring at my back? It's rude. You won't find anything back there anyway. Okay, that's somehow worse. Oh, wait, hang on. Don't fall in one of my trees. Also, behold my hell orchard. I I definitely made a series of mistakes when establishing this, but behold my hell orchard. In case it's not obvious, uh, cherries were my default fruit, which is why there are 8 million of them. And then my coconuts down here. And then all of my pears, and my peaches, and then my apples that haven't grown. 
And then I still don't have oranges because I keep not actually... So many community members have gone like, I have oranges, you can just come get them from my island and been like, that's a great plan. And then my brain going, but I don't want to socialize because I don't want to socialize. <laughs> and I feel really shitty about that, but... No, I haven't been dodging any of you, I just haven't played in two days. Also, wait, do any of you give me stuff for... Yeah, exactly, Um, It's that I do that, and then also... So, this is a thing that we talked about uh, the past couple days, where it's just like... I'm really used to... everyone leaving my house, except for me, by about 7 to 8.30... And then there's a very good chance that before COVID, I wouldn't see another human being until 7 p.m. And suddenly not having that is really fucking with me. <laughs> it's really fucking with me. Bunny Day is the best. I mean, I get stone eggs for hitting the rocks around here. I do that all the time. Oh, pro tip, if you want to find a whole lot of stone eggs, try going on a Nook Miles tour. Stone eggs are like free range, free weights, and those islands are the freest range there is. I, sh sure, sure, man. I don't, wait. I've got all of the eggs stored. I literally don't even need to go to an island. Hang on. I stored them for this reason. Yeah, it's, it's sort of why is everyone in my house, but also just like, oh god, everyone is in my house, and... because I'm I'm the homemaker it's just like I don't I can't I feel I, I can but I feel weird about cleaning because there's other people here so it's just gonna get dirty again and also there's other people here so I don't want to vacuum because the vacuum is loud and stu stupid internal dumb things like that hang on let me get all these dumb eggs I will stop by then in just a second apple uh, it means I'll have to close and then reopen my gate but we'll live Yes, I should craft something. Uh, I need to craft... This is the new one? Yes. I should have taken part in TQ's fishing tourney, but I just, I didn't think about it, and I was like, ah, yeah, I'm relaxing, or at least I'm trying to come... I'm trying to, I'm trying to relax. I think was the actual thing for yesterday. This, this is why I got that very good Happy Home Academy rating. Because this room has nothing but the horrible egg theme. Yeah. Hate all of these Wonka Pomo Memphis colors. I don't. I understood the Wonka part. I don't understand the other two. Um, but I'll be over there in just a second, then, Apple. Yes, behold my terrifying egg room. But turns out Happy Home Academy really likes it when you do a unified color scheme. Here's the deal, if you ever get short by one egg of a certain type, I can help you out. I'll give you one egg of your choice, but you have to do is give me three of a different type of egg. Bibbidi bop, not a bad deal, eh? What you need to say is, let's trade, and I'll know what you mean. So do you need something? I have eggs. Well, let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six. Wonderfully wonderful, you have all six types of eggs, hippity skippity, yay. All right, I'm gonna take one of each type. Is that okay? Hey, Marcusy. All right, here you are. What did you give me? It's a buddy day basket. It's time to celebrate. Here we go. Boingity yay, hippity hooray! It's a wonderful, fu wonderful egg filled day. All right, kid, enjoy the rest of your buddy day. Hey, Sky. I haven't talked to you in like three days. I have, because I keep trying to get fossils and I keep digging up eggs instead. Have you tried eating a bunny candy egg yet? Oh right, by the way, they're also supposed to be candy. Okay. 
You know when you see a spider in your house, you're getting the similar feeling from all the colors? Ah. Give me this weed. That was a weird phrase. Didn't think about it there for a second. Also, this chicken who just moved in and is wearing a night helmet, and I don't know why. That's just part of his model. Like, it's not a hat. It's just part of his model. Oh, Finn, that's awesome. That sounds like a much better... Oh, wait, hang on. I need to go get that, that present. That sounds like a way better Easter plan than ours, which I'm still confused by. Somehow... Somehow, the part of my family who isn't, who doesn't understand what streaming is, is doing some sort of Easter thing on Zoom, and I'm, I'm, I, I have, let's not say high hopes for however the hell this is going to turn out. I'm really afraid that I'm going to have to make all of the clothes, too. Oh no, how did you kill the first one? What did, what did you do to the poor starter? Also, I'm, I have to close the gate. Sorry if, if anyone was planning on visiting, but I need... Ooh, wait, 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 wait. Before I forget, before I forget, before I forget, I need to clear out my inventory. Hang on, hang on. There's a couple of things I need to do before I, before I do this silliness. And I forgot that I needed to, to clear out my inventory before doing this silliness. One, you... Yep, give me that cash. And... No, 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 do not bury 9,000. Because turns out... Turns out, uh... Hang on. While you can bury up to 99,000 bells in one of those holes... Like, th I think 30,000 is the guaranteed break-even point... Like, if you do 99,000, there's a small chance that uh, you'll get three bags of 99,000 from it, but it's not guaranteed. Okay, time to store everything. I don't want to use this item right I want to store this item. You know what? Fine. Fuck you, then. What the hell? Why can I not store this shovel? Oh, do I still have it equipped? I bet I still have it equipped. Yep. That's why. That's why. You forgot it for a few days and it went alcohol on you? Oh no, I'm sorry, Fane. Wait, is that a Gatsby emote? Nope, it just looks like a Gatsby emote. Okay. Uh, put in storage, put in sto- put everything in the storage. Oh wait, hang on, hang on, hang on. I have to go place this one, because I need to find out what- what heinous hell this one looks like. Oop, wait, not too close, too close, too close to the wall. Oh, it's just a little egg basket. That's adorable. Also, I feel the need to, to say that this is a bed. Because, of course, it's a bed. Because, of course, it's a bed. What else would it be? It's horrifying. Of course it is. No, that place. Oh, of course. It, I, I assume that they're all pillows, but yeah, it's probably not good for you at all. Let's leave this room because it's starting to hurt my eyes. Miriam, I am deeply confused and also love your life that you are doing a knitting Google Hangout. Put everything in storage because I need to make a bunch of cash. Oop, nope, not drop item. Hang on wall? What? Oh, I didn't realize this was a wall hanging one. What do you look like? You look fine. Put 
everything in storage. I really wish there was a way to do this faster. Oh, well, thank you, Fane. I mean, Miriam, I super get what you get that. I just also... The concept of a knitting knitting group uh, Google Hangout makes me smile. Also, I forgot to say, it's fucking snowing here right now. So on top of the fact that, like, we can't go outside for the obvious reasons, we also can't go outside because it's fucking snowing. Because of course it is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Give me my cash. Give me all of my cash so that I can drop it all on turnips. Uh, I'm really tempted to do the stupid thing and redeem all of my Nook Miles as bell vouchers, but that's only like... 3,000 each? Yeah, it's not worth it. Yeah. It's cozy inside weather, but not good if you need to run errands. Cardboard box, typewriter, cardboard box, and iron nuggets. Weird. <laughs> yes! The Isabel is in this game. Okay. Uh, last thing I need to do is I need to make as much cash as I can before going to visit Apple's Island by selling all of the fruit that is not native to my island because it sells better here. I really should not be growing this many, uh, cherries. I should, I should remove some of these cherry trees. Live the life of a cool hip, uh, cool hip granny. The only problem is that you have about 50 years too early. Yeah. Yes. The, so. These pears are not native to my island. These cherries are. So these cherries sell for less money on my island. But these pears and these peaches will sell for way more. I know, cat. I know. But because the cherries are native, I also was able to grow a whole bunch more of them without really meaning to. So, yeah. I really need to start doing some amount of terraforming on my island, but I haven't done it yet because I'm lazy. Also, because I haven't... I don't have KK Slider here yet, so... I should just do that, but... I have nothing- I'm sorry, I just have nothing to say as I'm just picking up 8 million pairs. <laughs> Is this the whole game? Kind of, yeah. This has extra silliness because of, um... Like, I think the, the best way to think of Animal Crossing is that it's kind of like Stardew, where it's... You have daily goals and things that you're setting for yourself. The difference being that unlike in Stardew where you can go, okay, I'm done with today and move over to the next day, this is tied to the real world unless you want to mess with your in-game clock. So it's, I'm done for today, guess I'll just stop playing then. Like, there are overarching goals, like, like I was saying, there's a concert that we are trying to set up to bring uh, a, a musician named KK Slider to the island. And doing so enables more control over the island. Specifically, it gives us, I think it's, it gives us a phone app that lets us terraform, basically. Like, at the start, this, this building is just like a tent that Nook is, like, living out of. And his two kids are also living out of and the first thing that you build after your uh after your tent is or one of the first things that you can build is 
a shop that both of his kids uh, run. Cat. Actually, they might be nephews. I feel like they're, they might be nephews. Come here, weed pile. Um, like the, it, it's very much like getting, getting whatever your daily goals are. So like the first daily goal is generally to try and get blathers and the museum to arrive, which means going out and catching bugs and fish and things. And it's just, it's just relaxing right up until the point that you realize that there's like one fish left that you need that only spawns in March or in April, or at least goes away at the end of March or April, and you're just like, I need to catch it today, what time does it spawn? Because that was me with at least two fish that I never caught in March. Like, I never caught a sturgeon or something else I'm forgetting. Don't remember what the other one was. Uh, and now I still need to catch a snapping turtle. Yeah, I guess that is also like the bundles in Stardew, true. But yeah, now I still need to catch a snapping turtle. Because they're only around for... Actually, no, I don't think they're only around for April. I want to sell. Yes, yes, I know you don't buy turnips on Sundays. I just need to sell you all of these peaches and pears. Look at the adorable thick pears. Peaches. Wow, I got that back. Whoa. What the fuck, brain? Just a casual 54,000 bells, dollars, whatever, for... Ooh, I need that blender. Uh, it's not a ton, but if I had sold the same amount of cherries, it probably would have been about half that. Like, considering that we've got 700,000, I think? It was it was a drop in the bucket, but... Because we're getting... We're gonna use it to buy a bunch of stocks, it's not bad. Also, these are a new thing. These are basically, like... I'd, I'd call them, like, daily quests, except that you just keep getting more of them. Oop, wait. There's more stuff I finished. I didn't realize. Oh, right, I turned in more weeds. Ah, yes. Sort of, they're, I'd call them daily quests, but they're really not that necessary. Like, they get you this alternate currency of Nook Miles that you need in the beginning of the game, because for your first... Like, there's the running thing of Tom Nook has you over a barrel, except that he doesn't really, because he's... He's like a capitalist who doesn't actually understand capitalism. So, for the first debt you owe him, he's like, I don't even want money, I just want you to, like, prove that you can get a bunch of Nook Miles for just doing stuff on the island. And after that point, you can either just convert them into money, or you can use them to get, go to, like, new different deserted islands for stuff, or you can use it for, like, learning new recipes. It, it's basically just a, a, a learn or get new things solution i i need to i need to travel i need to travel to the apples island yep um the apples island who's there's the code okay i was just like where's the code yes because i don't remember if i have thank you apple i i scrolled back up through the chat and cheated but thank you Yes, connect to the internet. <sighs> Plus, unlike with Destiny, there's no, like... Oh no, I didn't complete my daily, I've lost out on potential rewards. It's like, no, you didn't complete your... Your daily, so... Nothing bad happens. There's, there's no reason... The only thing that you get for completing it is Nook Miles, and a new daily that shows up that will also still give you Nook Miles. Um... 
no, wait, JFD L0. Because <laughs> I can't remember if I have. Right, I forgot that I knew that Apple's Island's name was Appalachia, because that's so good. Oh, it's so good. Apple, I know your starting fruit is apples. Did you have... I don't remember if you mentioned having to re-roll for that or not. Yes, think what would a dodo do while flying. Yes, that's a statement that makes perfect sense. I still love the pilot Dodo. He's awesome. You rerolled many times for it. Damn it. I thought that you got it just on like the... <clears throat> I thought I remember you saying that you got it on just like the first pick. Just perfectly. Cat, what the hell are you doing? Eight or nine? Jesus. Meanwhile, it seems like- oh, I hate you for being smart and actually laying your things out properly. <sighs> I need to do that too. I really need to do that. Okay, I, I, I can't take any of the fossils because I want to fill my inventory with freaking turnips, honestly. But I am going to check your DIYs in case any of them are stuff I don't know yet. Bamboo four lamp? Cherry blossom flooring. Ooh, steamer basket set. I don't think I know how to make this yet. Yep, this is Apple's Island. Apple is here somewhere. Like you can't visit an island unless they unless the the owner is here. Yeah, because I can't make cherry blossom well, I guess I do still have the the Ah, hey! So this This is Daisy May. She's part of the Sao Jones stock market. Hey, there's Apple. So, this is the way to to It it's not an it's just it's just banking puns. So, Daisy May as in uh Freddie May. No, Fannie Mae, Fannie Mae. Fannie Mae and Freddie Mac, those were the two big uh, banks that dropped us into the 2008 recession that then got bailed out. Sow Jones, Dow Jones, stock, like a celery stock, stock market, except that in this case it's turnips. Whose is that? Please, yes! I was just like, please tell me it's TQ's. Yes! Give me 35,000 turnips. Oh god, I'm gonna have to run back and forth, aren't I? So the thing here is that on Sundays uh, before noon, you can find Daisy May, who will sell you... Um, who sells you the turnip, or who still sells you the stocks, which you then have to store in some way and if you keep checking the store uh the the nook's cranny every couple of or every day uh they they buy stocks for different prices in the morning and then afternoon and you try and sell them for a profit but sorry apple yeah i'm gonna have to like come and go two more times i think But at least you have a more reasonable price than 108, which reminds me, uh, I need to go to that, uh, the turnip thing. Come here, stock market. Actually, you know what I should totally do? Uh... Ooh, no, no, that's too many. There we go. Yes. There. 
Um. Ooh. Hey, good news. There is a non-zero chance that depending on my stock prices tomorrow, I have five, five days this, no, four, four days this week uh, that may pay out 684 bells per stock on my island. Because um, if anyone hasn't... I'm trying to decide how I want to do this. So, for anyone who follows uh, Fuji on on Twitter, uh, he's been he and a couple of other people have been working on basically a uh, a stock market like bot is the wrong word. Uh, basically a, a Google Sheets spreadsheet that lets you enter the Sunday offer and then lets you tabulate like what, what gets offered on the rest of the week to see what your chances are of uh, like certain payouts throughout it. Like, here, I can actually just show it. I'm trying to decide if I want to share this as an editable editable thing amongst the community so that we can all keep it up to date together. But, basically, so, my island, Sunday offer was 108. So, depending on prices that I get throughout the week, uh, we might be on different price tracks for how much the stocks will sell for, with the 600 and uh, 48 being the one that we really want, because that will be a casual turn our 700 bell, or 700,000 bell investment into basically a 700, no, yeah, d d very nearly a 700% uh, return on investment. So, you know, the casual money, money breaking scheme. And now, because you can't store turnips, I have to drop them on my floor. Oh yes, and the the extra downside being, if you don't sell the turnips before next Sunday, they rot. So your money is just gone. Uh, yes, you can do plenty of things with the money. Um, the first... What do you mean there's no space? There's space right there. Uh, the first big thing is you can pay off your loan to Tom Nook and then immediately take out a significantly larger loan to improve the size of your house or to get more rooms. Like, that's why my house has one extra room, but there's... I believe you can add on a room on this side, a room on this side, a basement, and a second floor at the very least. There might be more on top of that. You can also spend it on getting more furniture and more clothes and the more money that you spend at the nooks cranny shop i think you need to spend seventy thousand bells at the nooks cranny shop and it will be the uh, they'll be able to upgrade it so that they can sell you more crap that you probably don't care about but still so yes there are many things to do it's all very silly and largely for its own sake but in these trying times, it's very nice. Oh yes, also you can buy clothes. But there's also an amazing community of people who are just like making awesome clothing designs. Cause like, hang on, I've got a really good one that if I weren't just wearing the silly egg stuff because egg day, uh, right, it's the phone app. Cause Amazing mid Midna dress. Hey, Scott Fry, how you doing? And now we must return to the Apple Island and see how many freaking stocks we can buy. I wish there was a way with Google Sheets to basically do... Make the rest of this editable, 
but not this, like, if I could lock this down to be like, this person is the only one who can edit this thing. Oh, has Dice been doing a bunch? I hadn't, I hadn't seen any of hers yet. I'm, I need to go see them then, because I feel bad that I haven't. Uh, yes, I want to visit someone. Not Harv's Island, because Harv's Island is deeply terrifying. Wow. I just realized I'm still wearing the egg backpack. I don't know why I didn't realize until now that Scott Fry Pirate that you did a... a an emoji with, or an emote, whatever, with a pirate eye patch. That's amazing. I love it. Sorry, I just looked at some of the names in the viewer list who were lurking and read one of them and was like, that's a name? And I'm jealous that I've never seen it before and I don't want to say it out loud because they're lurking and... Like, that would just be mean? Uh... Tired? Couldn't get to sleep until 11, 11 or, or 12 or 1? Yeah, you were watching Chewie's stream until, like, real late. And I think he was going until, like... I think he was going until at least 11 my time. So, like, 1 his time. I continue to love the dodos. Like I'm, I'm, I miss Cap'n. I love the dodos. They make me so happy. They're so dumb. They just make me so happy. Oops, I just realized that I moved all of my shit, so now I can't. Was it this one? No. Where did I put Twitch chat? Or other Twitch chat, because I've got you in two different screens now. Oh, there you are, cat. Jesus, scare the fucking crap out of me, why don't you? Yeah, I know. You were very spooky. I hope Captain comes back in some way, but I really like the dodos. <gasps> you have the sad face doggo whose name I don't remember. Ah, yes, we'll be making a water-based landing, but that's okay, because this is a seaplane. It's like, I, mm, that doesn't make me less concerned, but sure. But sure. Hi, Daisy May. Yep, I need, I need more turnips. Give, give, give turnips all turnips. Yay, we're able to buy slightly more this trip. Turnip for Bell. Turnip for Bell. Oh, right. Hang on. I can I can carry slightly more. Oops, that was silly. Now I'm just really hoping the 10th tech doesn't like, sh like, because I saw 10th tech come online, I'm really hoping 10th tech doesn't just like arrive and go, hey, my turnips cost eight, eight bells. I'm just like, fuck. Hey, Learning Death, how you doing? I see a dog. But they didn't come all the way over. Yeah, Daisy Bay is adorable. I'm... I feel really bad saying it, but I'm kind of glad that we have Daisy May instead of Sao Jones, because Sao Jones always scared me. Because, at least when I played the GameCube version. Oh my god, Goldie, you're adorable. Yes, a bunch of the characters in Animal Crossing are recurring. 
Um, so like Isabel first showed up in, uh, in <laughs> Isabel first showed up in, uh, uh, the, the 3DS game where you were mayor and basically she was the mayor, she was the mayoral assistant. So she, you would say, I want to do the thing and she'd make the thing happen. Yeah. New leaf. Tom Nook has been in every game. Oh, right. Uh, Tom Nook's been in every game. Blathers has been in every game. A bunch of the villagers. Um, I, the the way that, to think about the villagers is they're sort of like... Um, uh, Monster Hunter monsters, where there's a whole bunch that were in the very first game, and since then, they sort of like pick and choose which ones you're getting. Uh, and and add new ones every every game or so. This sheep's name is Dom. And they opened by shouting at me. Okay. Did I scare you? My bad. Sometimes get a little too pumped up. <laughs> I think it's a very safe bet that we're going to get uh, Brewster and Red back, just because... Um, yeah, there's a Godzilla. <laughs> Apple, your island is very silly, and I love it. Uh, just because people have already been able to establish that there is uh, an intention in the game to have um, a coffee shop open in the museum. And if a coffee shop opens in the museum, that means that... Uh, what's his name? Uh, the Brewster would be running the coffee shop, and if there's an expansion on the museum, the only thing that the museum is currently missing is paintings, which would give Red a reason to show up, too. For anyone who has no idea what the hell we're talking about, uh, let me see if I can stop by Apple's museum real quick. Um, the museum is sort of like, if you played Stardew Valley, it's kind of like the... Uh, crap. Um, what's it called? The, the bundles for the Junimos? where you can donate all of the... Oh, that's a nice incline. You can donate all of the animals and bur or bugs and bur bugs and fish and eventually fossils. That That is a terrifying looking duck man. I think duck man? <laughs> um... Bugs, fish, and then eventually fossils. But in previous games, there was a fourth wing where you could donate paintings. And Red is a shifty fox merchant who sells you... Uh, he can sell real paintings, but also can sell you forgeries. And Blathers, that owl, is the only one who can tell you if they're real or not. Or there might have been a way to determine... In oh, you have an Atlas Moth, fuck you. I don't play at night enough. I also don't have that spider. What is that spider? Oh, it's just a spider. Okay. Plan on getting an Atlas Moth model next to f uh, next time Flick is on your island to get a Godzilla versus Mothra. That's sweet. That's really sweet, Apple. So yeah, as you find more stuff, you can you donate them to the museum and they they get all of it. Oh, what? I forgot that the koi swim through here, because Biden has koi, too. I just never see them. Oh, and there's a water bug. Ooh, what are those? The f what are these fish? I don't think I have any of them. And I can't check, because we're not in the fish side. Stink bug. Oh, Keelyfish? I think I might actually have some of those. Do you have an Orchid Mantis? Because I'm not... I thought they were with the normal Mantis, but maybe they're not. And then the beautiful Butterfly House. Oh, this one's always so nice. I think I'm... I think I have all of these? I think I do. I don't have the snail. I just saw your snail. That one I actually know I don't have. 
And this is just moth and centipede. Oh, and pill bug. Yeah, centipede, moth, yep. Yeah, there's orchid mantis. Yeah, I don't know why I thought it was outside. And then this one, nothing. Ah, mole cricket. Ah, uh, I forgot how much of a pain these guys are to get, so I just didn't have one for a while and kept hearing the, the awful noises. So long locust. Ant. Oh, where do you get ants? Also, your ants appear to be escaping. And you have house flies? Where the fuck do you get house flies? Okay, I have fleas. You know what I mean. Garbage? Oh. Like setting garbage out? Just like setting it down and they'll spawn on it? Ooh. Anything in there? Tarantula. Ah, okay. Just can't see him. And then the wharf roaches. And the hermit crab, right? Yes, the hermit crab. Always love the hermit crab. Is that for the fly and the ants or just for the fly? Because I, I don't think I've seen ants. Either way, I I adore your assortment of bugs. Ants are spoiled turnips? Oh, I don't want to spoil any turnips. Ah, oh, fuck. I'm probably never getting ants. I That's a lie. I'll get ants at some point. I assume only if you spoil them, like, outside. Oh, hey, the fat goldfish. Yeah, keelyfish, goldfish, Popeye, Popeye goldfish, that's it. Oh, no, Popeye and Ranchu, okay. And guppies. I think I have... Guppies? I don't think I have any of the goldfish, though. <gasps> Snapping turtle! Yeah, crawfish, got plenty of them. Don't have any snapping turtles. We've got the koi and the carp and the tadpole. And the bitterling, yup, and the loach. Black bass, carp, koi. Yup, 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 yup. I feel so dumb that I missed sturgeon. Like, I missed sturgeon and something else in March. Pale chub. Stringfish. That was in March, too, wasn't it? Like, that was only in March? Because I definitely missed that, too. Okay. I got the freshwater goby. I got the yellow perch. Crucian carp. Yup, yup, yup. I have the golden trout. I don't think I have the cherry sam- Actually, I don't think I have the cherry salmon or the char yet. But neither of them is gone, like, is is left. Yeah, I know they'll be back around. I just feel silly for having missed it. Who was it that, or no, that was someone who tweeted about uh, having finally, oh, damn it, you have one. I was about to say, someone caught an, uh, a marlin at, I think, TQ's community fishing thing. Yeah, horse mackerel. What the, no, fuck you. I want to see the marlin. And the tuna? Oh, I have not caught tuna either. Anchovies I definitely have caught. Yeah, blue marlin and tuna. Both the char and the cherry salmon should be, still be available? Yes, I believe they are. Oh, I don't have an orphan. Oh, God, is that a coelacanth? Is that a coelacanth? Wow, I don't have any of these. Yeah, I know I don't have an ore fish, but I... Oh, wait, I do have a football fish. That's a coelacanth. I hate you. I love it. I hate you. And then just random diving outfit. Sure, sure, sure. Sorry, we're just looking at Apple's uh, museum now because Apple's is way more complete than mine. You're a slave to this museum. I mean, it's probably the best thing to be a slave to. I love the museum too, though. It's always been my favorite part of Animal Crossing. These I did get. I love these things. The sea butterflies. Oh, they're so pretty. And then the tropical fish. These I feel like I'm not doing too bad on. I say that and immediately see you've got something I don't have, because I don't have any surgeon fishes. 
But I did get butterfly and clownfish. Oh, right, I forgot about this. Oh, red snapper and sea bass, those I definitely have. The That's the zebra lion turkey fish or whatever. That one I've got. Ooh, I don't have you. You were in the first Animal Crossing, but I don't remember your name. <gasps> seahorse? Oh, my, I don't have a seahorse. I do not have a seahorse. Oh, and you've got both of the flatfish, too? Yup, yup, yup. Yeah, red snapper. There's the dab and the flounder. Yeah. And then, what's this other one? Zebra turkey fish. Barreled knife jaw. Yeah, that one. Because that was the thing you wanted in, an, in the very first Animal Crossing when fishing, because it sold for the most. Actually, red snapper may have sold for more. I just remember that those two were the big things you were always trying to fish up in Animal Crossing 1. In Animal Crossing. <laughs> because they sold for the most money. Yeah. What the hell? Uh, oh, I'm gonna screw up this name. Oh, no, I'm not. I just figured it out. Meandering Masquerade. Thank you very much for the follow, friend. Welcome to the lair. I hope you enjoy the lore. This is definitely Meandering Stream. Not entirely on accident, but still. Right, I can't steal any of Apple's fruit right now because I need to go return with my ill-gotten turnips. Because I think I've only got like 30 minutes left before Apple's... Oh, wait, no. Apple was on a weird time scale. Because when we arrived, it was 11.04. It's more just I don't have the... I don't have the inventory to steal any of your fruit. Half an hour left? Okay. Ugh. Like, I'm gonna drop my turnips, come back by the last... By the last batch, and then... Do you mind if I steal some oranges? Because they're the only thing I'm actually missing. Like, I've got apples that aren't growing because I planted them wrong, but I can just shift them. I've just been silly and haven't done so. Oh, who's my patched out cat? Don't worry, I'm not going to turn the light on, cat. I'm just turning on the cam. I need to check and see if I need the fossils. Honestly, I don't remember. <sighs> Oof. I'm just gonna crack my everything real quick. Uh, this is Calcifer. Or Cal. He is a very good boy. Except when he's not, which is 40% of the time? Uh, my native fruit is cherries, which is why there are way too many cherries on this island. Not audible, but he is now purring in his sleep. It's very easy to make purr. Too many turnips, too many turnips. Something, something, too many turnips. Okay, I need to... I, I definitely may have accidentally dropped some turnips uh, behind my my dumb desk in this room earlier. So I found them yesterday, and had I realized that letting them rot would have given me ants, I probably would have done it, but whatever. Oh, can't reach the spot over there. Gotta store all these turnips. And I'm not quite mad enough to do any of those absurd outdoor storage areas that I've seen other people doing. Though I'm almost at that point. But I, I need that cash. All that sweet stock market cash. It is far too many turnips to be reasonable, but yes. Insert some sort of joke about feeding starving 
no, let's not make any sort of awful joke about that. Plus, hey, you can still totally eat these turnips. Why on earth you'd want to eat this many turnips, I don't know. I, my, my home is full. Shit. Hang on. Hang on. Gotta drop some in here. Oh, right, yeah, I guess I can also sell cherries on your island for stupid cash, too. Shit. Apple being the true gamer. The actual gamer out of the two of us. Did you just purr louder just because I said that no one could hear your purring? Can you tell that he's uh, not really on the camera? Gotta optimize that star stock market. Yeah, especially if it turns out I might possibly be one of the really significant payout islands. Yeah. there. It's not a great chance, but there is a chance that I can have an absurd uh, payout on my island. <laughs> Nipping in the egg room? I... Mm, no? No. No. Look, we try and not go into the egg room, okay? It's horrifying. I'll say it, Marcus. How you doing? Like, the, the egg room is a scary place. We do not talk about the egg room. Except to acknowledge that it exists, and it's maybe a mistake. Oh, I super will, Apple. Like, that's part of why I'm going like, hmm, do I just want to share this specific spreadsheet with, with the community and trust that the people who have access to it won't fuck with it? Just so everyone can see what what prices everyone else has. But, I don't know. I haven't decided yet. I feel like people who end up with very high payout item or islands tend to share it anyway, so. Because, what was it, Grey Knight last week ended up with one that was, like, just shy of 500 per turnip. And considering that each stack is, uh... Each stack looks like it's 10, but it's actually 100 turnips. That, it's just so much. It's just so much. Give me all these fucking cherries. I guess I should also take the coconuts. Oh, God. I... I... I want to optimize. I, I should optimize. I shouldn't. Because it probably... Well... I was about to say it shouldn't because... It won't be fun to watch on stream. It's like, I'm playing Animal Crossing on stream. There's literally nothing that happens in this game. It's just being adorable and... Wrecking the planet, kind of. Or trying to be slightly less awful about wrecking the planet. Also, I forgot to show off some of the other members of my island. This is Precious. Or no, Fuchsia, her, the thing she says is precious. Right. I think she's supposed to be a pig, but her face doesn't look piggish to me, so... Uh, and then, last but not least, there is Graham. Oh, I guess she could be a deer. That would make sense. And then there's Graham, who is a massive nerd. Um, the reason why I say he's a massive nerd is because if I were to visit his house right now, which I can't because he's not in it, um, his wallpaper are, is just servers. It, it's just servers. It's very strange to walk into. Oops, wrong button. But yeah, her being a deer makes way more sense. I don't know why I never thought about that. Oh, right, I also need to check your nook's cranny. That's a weird phrase to say. To see if you've got any any stuff that I am slowly trying to accrue. Give cherries. Give all cherries. <laughs> Here is your pet-friendly car. 
This is very difficult to do one-handed. Uh, there's too many buttons. I don't know if you can... No, you can't quite tell. He's also doing this adorable thing. Oh, shit. Hang on. No. No. Sorry, the tripod. He's just got his tail, like, hooked over the edge. Yeah, I know. I'm sorry, Cat, but I had to move it for a second. See, it's back now. It's like, yes, behold me in all of my adorable sleeping splendor. Oh, he's quite adorable. The problem is he knows he's adorable. And he attempts to use it to his own advantage very often. Frankly, it's the same as the other, as the, the dogs in the house, too. But, yeah. Oh, God. I made a mistake yesterday and looked at... I'm on a mailing list from one of the 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 sites that basically like collates adoptable dogs and they sent me an email yesterday uh, that was basically I think it was like here's here's three dogs that match some search criteria that you put in at one point and one of them is a four-year-old adorable Great Dane. Just like, oh, nope, nope, can't do it, want to do it, can't do it, shouldn't, 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 shouldn't. And it's... The worst part is that, like, it's from a, a rescue... <clears throat> it's from a rescue that we're usually able to kind of ignore because they cover all of the Rocky Mountains. So, usually it's like is actually in Utah, and we go, okay, that's that's really far. And, you know, in this case, it's just like, ah, shit. It's in, call like, they are being fostered in my state. And if they're being fostered in my state, there's, like, a 75% chance that that means that they're really nearby, because the way that this state works is that almost everyone lives within, like, a three-hour radius of Denver, or they live out in the middle of fuck nowhere. There, There is no middle ground. I'm including the mountains as the middle of fuck nowhere, because they basically are. Give me all the coconuts. Da, da, da. I don't know what that... That wasn't even a song. It was just... Me demanding access to all of the coconuts. I definitely grew these coconut trees way too close to get... Wait, hang on. Does that one still have coconuts? Nope. Okay. Got a couple more coconut trees to hit up, and then I will go pillage Apple's Island for the final time. Work is so slow today. Is that a good thing or a bad thing? Also, you're working with your Switch? Oh, that was weird. Sorry, the dog just jumped up on the couch and did so so forcefully that it shook my desk. Oh, right. Working from home. I... Mm. Look. I... I acknowledge that working from home is the standard at this point, and should be, but that doesn't make it still slightly weird in my brain. Gonna hiccup and die now. I really should move my bridges and shit around, but whatever. I wonder if it would would have actually made that many more trips if I'd just kept all of my tools with me, but whatever. <sighs> Hello, DIY recipe. Which of you am I still missing? Bunny Day Festive Blue. I thought I knew all of the. I do. Okay. Hey, Apple, do you need Bunny Day Festive Balloon Recipe? I don't know which one it is, since there are two of those for some reason. Oh, wait. Hang on. Another DIY. Nope. Not that one. This one. This one. Open this one. Oh, I thought I did know Garden Bench. I guess not. Yes. Learn the recipe. Become the recipe. Nope, that's not a thing. That's not a thing. 
Gotta go faster. Gotta go faster. Well, okay, no, we don't actually. Like, we've got 15 minutes. Because uh, Daisy May goes away at noon. But Daisy, Daisy May goes away at noon on the island what you are on. So, Apple's Daisy May will go away in 15 minutes. Mine will still be here for another hour and 15 minutes. But mine is also selling turnips for way more than I want to spend on them. Just, just way more. Okay. The final trip. Except now I have to run my, my adorable pastel covered ass back to, I need to stop saying these things and then giving myself a second to think about them. Because if I just moved along, moved away from that thought, it would have been fine. But as soon as I stopped for a second to go like, that was a weird phrase. It's like, nope, now I'm thinking about it too much. Huh. I... I also just remembered that... I think Apple gave me... Or threw, in, threw into the community Discord a picture of how to do... I think it's Fantasy Costco for your town theme. And somehow I jumped from that to remembering, wait, Cameron tweeted a question if anyone had figured out how to do Gwyn's theme, and I think someone did in his responses, and I kind of need to do that instead, honestly, because Gwyn's theme is real good. And if I weren't already using uh, a remix of... Oh god, what is Undone by the Blood for? Uh... Oh wait, should I not say... Dodo code? What? Fuck. How did I fuck up? Shit. Oh, I did local? What the hell, brain? Okay, I wanna fly. Visit someone else. Online play. Ah, okay. Uh. Oh, it is Gearman's theme. Okay, I was like, I'm pretty sure this is Gearman's theme? Yeah, it is. Because um, our, our sign-off music is uh, Undone by the Blood, which is an OC remix version of... Or it's Alex... No. Whose is it? It's an OC remix version of Undone by uh, by the Blood, which is Garman's theme. Um, I can't see the code anymore because it scrolled up. Where did it go? Where did it go? Code, where did you go, you fucker? There it is. I keep trying to do JDL, but no, it's JLD. No, it's JFD. What the fuck, brain? JFDL. Zero. There we go. Nope. Yes, the final trip to Appalachia. That reminds me, I need to do the the connection thing. Um, Fallout 76 is coming to Steam, and if you own it on Bethesda's awful Hell Launcher, um, you can connect it and have a copy over on Steam when it comes out. I think it comes out either the 13th on Steam, or it's coming out on the 14th, because 14th is the day that Wastelanders... AKA, hey, we're actually going to add NPCs because turns out that was a stupid artificial limitation we put on ourselves. Uh, happens. <clears throat> also, the secret tech is probably going to be don't play on the 14th because either their servers are going to be slammed or 
their servers are going to be dead and it'll be depressing but considering that there are pe still people playing it'll probably be the slammed option <clears throat> Apple, stop that. You're being adorable. Also, is that a custom design? Or is that something that you got? Or is that out of, like, normal clothes? I can never remember what reactions I have equipped. Oh, you know what I should have checked also? Was what the hot item was, but oh well. Oh, well. Okay, I... I want them, but I also need to first make sure that I can fill my inventory with, uh... Uh, with stuff. Oh, yeah. Uh, Apple, do you want this festive balloon DIY, or can I throw it away? Or sell it? I'll say fragile. Sounds like they're trying now. Also wouldn't be as successful as the revival, uh... No Man's Sky. Look, I, I will forever maintain that I really like Lo No Man's Sky at launch, and that I'm, I didn't initially like the stuff that they added, but I've come around on it. But it's still stupid fun, and very, very relaxing. Yes, give me that sixty-five thousand bells. Sorry, I just realized that said 65. Damn it! It said 65, 420. We were so close. We were so close. We were so close. We were so close to the dumb Pavlovian number. Also, welcome, Fragile. How are you doing? Uh, now then, Daisy May, where'd you go? I need, I need your stuff. Hello. Why do you have... It's a fresh cooler. Okay. What is a fishing rod stand? Okay, I need to... I need to see which one looks better. Okay, so... Ah, I'm gonna say no to the blue because it matches my hair and that feels like it's backwards. Oh, turn this way, brain. <gasps> Actually, no. Wait, this is probably customizable, isn't it? Apple, I hate you. This is perfect. I, I, if it's customizable, especially, but also this work apron is adorable and I love it. Nope, that's the egg party dress. This one. I, that makes me very happy. I hate you so much, Apple. I'm doing good, Fragile. I I had a couple of days off? Let's go with that. I had a couple of days almost kind of off, but otherwise, now now that I'm back, I'm I'm feeling quite quite good. Yes, give me the turnips. Bestow unto me all of the goddamn turnips. Thank you. Beautiful. And now, I just need to go steal all of uh, Apple's oranges that aren't nailed down. And also probably some apples. I'm I'm not actually going to steal all that many. Like, can I just take, like, six? I don't want to take all your fruit, because it. I know it takes a bit to grow back. Yay! Well, if you say as many as you want, then I'll take nine! Well, nine oranges. I still really don't actually need that many apples. I just need to plant them in a not stupid place. Can't actually tell if I picked up that other orange. Yes, I think I did. Going to operate in the assumption that I did. Because I foolishly set up all of my trees in one place around the town hall, and I think I've decided that that was a bad idea. Um... And I, I need to figure out where I want to put them instead. But... Because I... 
I super like Apple's thing here of doing, like, the town hall and the, the, the shops next to each other. Like, I really like that idea. Because I've very much been going for more of uh, what I'm going to charitably describe as a scattershot approach. Where it's like, I've I've let the houses be wherever they want. Oh yeah, I guess I would bet that the eggs are... So that is an adorably stupid shirt. It... It's just a shirt dress that says sea lion and I don't know why I like it. <laughs> I don't know why I like it. Ooh, I do want the glasses. Shit, I have no money. I spend all of it. <laughs> oh, right. Of course, there are other color options. I'm so bad about remembering to use the dressing room, I never check. I, I always forget to check the dressing room. Okay, that's very cute. I like that it calls out very specifically that it's pleather. Oh, what did you do? No, that does not look good on an Animal Crossing character. <laughs> One day when I have money. <laughs> One day. I love that the beard copies your hair color. <laughs> no. Sorry, the model on this just looks so long. I was like, what the hell? Ah, I like my dumb boots. I think I'm still wearing either the steel toad or the recycled boots. Well, not so much nothing caught my eye, sorry, is I have no money. The, the money part is definitely part of the... Oh my god, you little... Damn it, Apple. Hang on. I have to go do a thing. I mean... For me, Om, um, I I'm actually I I'm going through laser treatment to remove the patchy, like to remove what little facial hair I grow, because I actually can't. I don't even before it I didn't grow any kind of beard. It's like it it would grow out to about a centimeter and then stop growing, and it was like hair wouldn't grow here or here or here or here or here. It's like what? Okay, let's see here then. Um, trying to decide. Actually, I don't think I really have anything like red in Animal Crossing, so sure. So yes. Oh wait, did I? No, I still want to buy more. Fuck you. No. Want to buy more. Yes. Honestly, that was when I when I worked in kitchens, that was sort of my thing was just like I I didn't shave because I didn't have to most of the time and I got very good at just like I don't have to and therefore also don't want to. I'm not currently wearing neon, am I? I think I might be, actually. Um. And the kitchens that I worked in had a very stupid rule of basically... You are allowed to wear... Or allowed to have a beard if you come into the kitchen with a beard. So provided I never got rid of it, I was fine. And it was just like, you just have to wear a beard net. And I took fucking advantage of that. Technically, my glasses are orange and black. 
but black is probably the closest I'm going to get. One day, crown. One day. Now, if only there were backpacks. I don't feel like there's terribly many good backpacks, honestly. Yarr. Okay. Oh. What did I get? Kix sells the backpacks? Wait, Kix? Which one's Kix? I also need a better hat. But the problem is that I'm trying to find, like, oh, right, 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 right. Is he coming back, too? Do we know if he's coming back? Did we meet Cat? I don't think we met Cat. He does once a week. Oh, I don't think I've seen him then. Your face is terrifying. I... Just something about the cat faces has always struck me as a little bit off. I don't know why. Like, nothing against cat, specifically. Just the cat faces in Animal Cro- Oh my god, that's adorable. The cat faces in Animal Crossing have always been a little bit wibbly, for lack of a better way of putting it. I also have a pagoda that I'm trying to figure out what to do, and I think I'm going to grow a whole bunch of bamboo around it as well. I'm a little annoyed that they seem to have made bamboo... <laughs> okay, so here's the thing. Bamboo has been in the past two Animal Crossing games, and in the last game, bamboo grew like bamboo, which is to say a weed that you could not fucking fight off. Now, it just grows like one shoot and that's it ever. I mean, in my defense, I was gonna steal it, but I was planning on stealing the Pagoda plus bamboo from TQ. <laughs> but I also wanted to specifically do it around my museum, so it's just that I need to, like, I need to start getting my my shit moved around at my place. I also definitely need a better hat. Because I want a hat that doesn't cover my hair, that's just like something on my head. I just realized how many villagers you have. Holy shit. Because you've got... Two, these are... You've got two houses here. I didn't realize that you... Huh. Yeah, I didn't even know what the limit was, but I guess... Yeah, ten would make sense. So who is this one? Sandy. Oh! I'm guessing you're Sandy? Yep. I'm still so annoyed that I had to reset our original island uh yeah i see that you've got a whole bunch right i'm covering the map um i can see that you've got a whole bunch of them up top i'm still sad that we, that i had to reset our first island because we had uh we had one of the kangaroos and i have not seen terribly many people who have the kangaroos and i'm trying to remember what her name was and it's just left my skull it's just completely gone Yeah, no. And I was really happy, too, because she wasn't one of the... I'm sorry. For anyone who hasn't played Animal Crossing, the reason why I keep just suddenly not running is because I don't want to run over Apple's flowers. Because it doesn't kill them, but it makes the flower itself go away. And I don't want to do that. He's, Apple's got very nice flowers. Hello, whoever's home. I meant to just check your name, but I guess this works, too. 
Oh, you're the deer person. Hi. Bo. Oh my god, you are a deer. Yeah, I guess that means Fuchsia probably is, uh... Uh... Honestly, um, the, the feature that they added is that you don't completely wreck the flowers. Because it used to be that running through flowers enough times just killed the flower. Now all it does is make the flower itself go away so that the plant can, like, regrow it. <laughs> yes, I am a spy. I am a spy for shield, and therefore very bad at being a spy. And yeah, to prevent griefing. Yeah. I mean, that's also why, unless you're marked as best friends, you can't just, like, show up and, like, if... Actually, I don't remember if Apple and I are down as best, best friends, but if I were visiting as a best friend not through the Dodo Code, I would be able to eat a bunch of fruit and dig up this whole tree and take it with me. And that's part of why they make it sort of make that feature locked behind being a best friend. I don't have a ladder with me. Um. Crap. I have to go buy a second, buy a ladder. Because I want to see all. Do you have all of your people just trapped up there? You're just keeping them all trapped up there, aren't you? No, no, stop that. I'm buying a ladder and giving your damn shop 400 or bells or something. Uh, oh, wait, you can't buy a ladder. I thought, I thought you could buy a ladder. I guess you can't buy the ladder. You can only buy the DIY recipe for it. That's dumb. Yes, Om, um, but also... Th this shop is really odd in that... If you spend... 70,000 bells... At the shop, it will... The the brothers will upgrade it. Thank you, sorry. Um, and they don't care if... Say, you buy an item and then immediately sell it back to them for like an eighth the price, but still. Uh... They're just like, yep, you bought an item that was that that was added to your the money you have given us. Just like the idea that you're keeping all of these villagers trapped up here. Freckles. I don't know who Freckles is. I know that there's an incline, but now I have a ladder, so fuck it. Goldie, okay. Lobo. Oh, I remember Lobo. Are you home? I had Lobo on my island on the GameCube. Yeah. I very much appreciate describing himself as a crouton. Also, the fact that he's inside wearing a jacket and not the frankly terrifying Bunny Day outfits. Clearly, Lobo best person on this island. Save for maybe Apple. Bruce. I... Are you Bruce? Gonna be honest, I saw the name Bruce and assumed that would be a shark. But hey... I really assumed shark. Oh. I mean, I should do something with my secret beach, but I haven't done anything at all with it. Wow, you have a very secret beach. Good lord, how do you even get down here? Oh, that's adorable. And you get down here by not coming at it from a stupid angle, that's how. Now all I can think of is, I think it was Beach? Hi, Goldie. Uh, 
um, I think it was Beach tweeted one, or no, no, sorry, yes, it was Beach. Beach has created a, a man's romance on his island. Oh, you're Freckles. I would not put the name Freckles with a duck, honestly. Oh God, is BT Dubs your catchphrase? Oh God, is BT Dubs your catchphrase? <laughs> I mean, honestly, I thought that villagers didn't leave the island. They just, like, sent a clone to another island. Where are you so I can give you this damn ladder back? Where are you so... I'm leaving this ladder here. I'm leaving this ladder by zipper. Oh, wait, what? Oh. Oh. There. Thank you very much for the, the loan of your ladder. Whose house was it over here? No, do not run through the flowers. Did I meet this person? Dom. Yes, yes I did. The, the totally not a Dom sheep. Huh. Zipper didn't see me, he was briefly relaxed. Oh yeah, so what are these? Left Megaloside. I don't know if I have Megalodon bits. Terra Body, Patchy Tail. I wish I could remember what that looks like. T-Rex Torso, and Kylo Tail, Mammoth Skull. Megacero Tail. And Megacero Skull. Ooh! We've just got lots of stuff out here. Marine Pop Wall. Wait, is that a different chef's outfit or is that the same one? Or is this the is this the green one? Yes! Okay, hang on. Just as a rule, hey, don't don't wear Don't wear pumps in the kitchen. The tights are actually probably fine. Honestly, that's closer to real pants than most chefs are wearing, but don't don't wear pumps in a kitchen. Everything else about this actually makes relative sense. But I'm putting the silly retro dress back on. That's what's throwing me off is the backpack. The backpack does not go with this. I must return home. I must return to my people. Only pajama pants in the kitchen? Basically? Okay. They're like pajama pants, but with more structure. <laughs> like, honestly, that's what checks are. I'll say, Odinson, how you doing, man? Oh. <laughs> the only thing that backpack goes with is a paint truck accident? Yes, exactly. But only a pastel paint truck. Like, even a normal paint truck is just like, uh, no, that's too much for us. Right, I'm doing this not on the live view. I'm doing this not on the OBS view. I'm doing this on the live view. So I can't... I might aim too far. Okay, good. Well, thank you, Apple. I, I wish there was an easy way of just going like, hey, my my home is always open to people. Every kitchen you worked in, cooks slash chefs wore legit pajama pants. In my experience, certain kitchens are like, no, you wear checks. And a lot of other kitchens are like, wear whatever the hell you want, which usually ends up meaning jeans. And then a cup. Like, I feel like jeans are really common just because if it's a kitchen where you're legitimately doing a lot of knife work, you want to have something a little bit tougher. And if it's not something like that, then it's always, like, leggings and tights. Just always. I have to drop off all my goddamn turnips. 
We have so many fucking turnip. Wait, hang on, there's space for another turnip there. Why would you lie to me about this game? All black, black jeans, black shirt, black beanie. I used to do that. Usually, though, I ended up... The company that I worked for ended up deciding that they wanted to do brown for chef coats. So, eh. I mostly just wore, wore brighter colors because it was like, I don't want to wear brown all the time. So, no, let me have at least some kind of pleasant colors. I do not have enough space in my house for all of these goddamn turnips. Oh god, the worst part is I still need to make an arch. I don't remember. I feel like the the reasoning... They explained reasoning to us, and I think the actual reasoning was it was cheaper. Because um, at the time, I worked for a massive, massive company. I was wearing neon tights. I thought I was. And those were steel toe boots. Good. Because um, at that time, I worked for a company that friend has eaten eight or has eaten a hundred turnips by accident she was not happy i can fucking imagine um at the time i was working for compass group which is the the frame of reference that i always give is that compass group is the ninth uh the last time i was paying attention to these statistics which has been a little bit uh was the ninth largest employer in the world and the 11th largest uh in the united states and not, like, in terms of employing food people, just in terms of, in general, they are the ninth largest employer on the planet. Because they're the people who do, um, like, every place that has to feed human beings that you don't think about having to feed human beings. So, like, they do, they, they, they have subsidiaries that feed prisons, they have subsidiaries that are in charge of vending machines. They have subsidiaries that do, uh, like, corporate dining and culinary, or not culinary, sorry, and, uh, uh, schools. So they've got, like, schools and then colleges. Um, and they also have a subsidiary that does, like, elder care. Good for 45 to 55 old folks. Most of them are nice and some are even coherent. <laughs> Diets are diverse. Yeah. <laughs> And I worked for two different Compass subsidiaries. Uh, I worked for Urest, which is technically their corporate branch, and Chartwells, which is their... Ed technically, it's their education branch, but then, while I worked for Chartwells, they split it into Chartwells and then Chartwells K-12. through Because, for some reason, they needed a different subsidiary to handle high school? Eh. I don't know. Um, right, storage. I need to get my stuff out of, uh, storage. What do we need specifically? We need all of my tools. That's what we need. Also, these weeds that I think I might be able to use for something now. Oh, and these eggs, because we've got another thing we can do with that. Oh, and these fossils. I put too much stuff in all of my storage. Okay, so we need to make the arch. Because it's the only thing I haven't made yet. And I'm really, really hoping that they're not going to make me make all of the outfits. gonna make me make all of the fucking outfits, isn't he? Okay, was there anything else that I needed to make? Uh, oh, rip, fuck, okay. Well, time to get that part done, then. Come here, seasonal. I was so happy when I was like, ah, yay, I could just make one that... Um, that's why I still have that. That is honestly why I still have that Ammonite shell, because I'm like... Praise Helix? 
Do I have to keep them? Can't I just sell them? Can't I just sell them? I just want to sell them, though. I do... I do really like that there's... They get, like, a check mark for, like, hey, you made this. Don't worry, you don't need to make it again. Who's my good cat butt? Earth egg as opposed to sky egg? Yes, there are sky eggs. So earth eggs are ones that you dig up. Stone eggs come out of stones when you smack them. Uh, sky eggs come from the, the presence in the sky. Uh, water eggs are eggs that are pretending to be fish. I'm not making any of this up. I know it sounds like I probably am, but I'm not. Uh, there's leaf eggs, which are in... They're in trees, but they're actually in trees... Like, they're pretending to be fruit, so I don't know why they're called leaf eggs. Who the hell knows? Uh, what are the other... What's the other one? Oh, yeah, and then wood eggs, which you get out of... Um trees. Feel like you had a fever dream like this once? I have a bad joke about that, which is mostly that I- so, have you ever had one of those dreams where you- you wake up after the fact and then sort of go about your normal day and then something happens and you go, wait a second, did I actually just have a dream about that because it was something absurd or something really boring? Because I woke up this morning and started to go about my morning. It was like, ah, yes, nice and relaxing. And then went... I'm having a memory of doing a thing that I definitely did not do. Did I literally dream last night about just... Going to a Best Buy? I did. I had a dream last night about just going to a Best Buy. And not feeling guilty about going outside. <sighs> Like, I don't even like going to Best Buy. But sure. Really vivid dreams to the point where it messes with your memory? Yeah, I've had those. Definitely had some of those. Not many, but definitely a couple. Are you really annoyed that I stopped petting you now? Yes, you are actually annoyed that I stopped petting you now. Going outside and doing shopping things in person? <laughs> <laughs> something that can only happen in a dream in the this the year of our lord 2020 yeah also you've done it you've crafted all the egg nonsense and freed yourself from zipper's hell i'm literally doing that right now 10 hey 10 i'm i'm gonna regret this question how much are your turnips how much are your turnips oh crap i'm gonna be short on making the shoes No, no, no. How, how much do your turnips cost to buy, damn it? I need one. I need one sky egg. Fuck off. Okay, we can go trade for it, though. What? Why do your turnips cost one million? What have you done? What unholy abomination have you unleashed upon the world? Can you hear how much he's grumbling? Just from that slight shift, he's just like, Okay. We need one sky egg. We had one friend with a 580 buyout last week and decided to run some of it back. But how does that mean that, like, th how, I I'm confused why that means that your individual turnip price is one million. Because I think you're fucking with me. Also, I just need one sky egg. And now they're not appearing. Zipper, give unto me a sky egg. Well, yeah, th that's what I'm asking though, Ten. How? What? Oh, God. I'm asking how much your, what your turnip price is. That's right, I need you to do one more- wait, so I didn't have to make all those fucking clothes?! <sighs> Can 
Gotta craft a toy that looks like me! Oh, God. The felt abomination just pulled at kids these days. Yup. Yes, siri! It's a womp. Wobbling zipper toy. Craft this recipe and a super de duper prize is yours. Bunny's honor. Okay, what the hell do we need to craft this horrible abomination? Your price is 98? Okay. I was like, shit. That's that's only one less. That's not actually that, that amazing. Okay, what do we need for it? Please tell me it's one of each. Ah, it's horrifying. Okay, it's... Uh, I need to go hunt eggs then. I thought I heard it, but nope. I need sky eggs. Game, gib sky egg. Deliver unto me sky egg. Gibbs Geegs? No, I think that's that's getting a little close to uh, asking for Skelliger. Which seems like a bad idea to ask for. Honestly. Like, they scary. Okay, one. Two more Sky Egg. Okay, got it. So Ozzy is basically one of those people who goes, the red M&M is the best. Because I have decided that it is the best. Can't wait for your villagers to talk about something that isn't eggs. That is bold of you to assume that they're going to actually stop caring about eggs. Heck, it took me like two days to get them to stop talking about my birthday because I kept giving them cupcakes because I forgot to give them out on the first day. I hear another sky egg. Where is it? Reveal yourself, sky egg. Shit, is it the other way? Oh god, am I going the wrong direction? Or was it just a hallucination? Did I not actually hear sky egg noise? Damn it. Fine. I'll go trade for the sky eggs. Ooh, wait, must must pick weeds. Actually, wait. Uh, before I forget, wasn't there a DIY recipe I could make for a backpack that looks less stupid with weeds? Equipment, equipment. Yeah, this one, the knitted grass backpack. That one looks sweet. However, now I still, I need to make, I need to trade for the sky eggs. I can't have that one thing sitting there taunting me forever like, Haha, you didn't make this one, asshole. Yeah, that, Odinson, that's part of why the secret was to do, um, fish bait. Because fish bait does not spawn water eggs. It only spawns fish. Shit. No! No! You motherfucker. You motherfucker. Shut up. Shut up. I need to trade. Give Sky Egg. Look, I've got shitloads of leaf eggs. Give me sky eggs. Yes! Stop making me confirm! You terrifying rabbit demon. Okay. How many more did I need? Was that the last one? Because I needed... Do I need two or did I need four to make the... The terrifying zipper toy? Nope. 
I want it season. Okay. I need four. Crap! I need to do two more trades. Okay. Butts, 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 butts. It's taunting me. Oh my god, stop talking. Yeah, the making one fish bait at a time definitely sucks. What? Shit, no. Uh, mm. Yes, let's trade. There we go. That's the one I wanted. I need more sky egg. Uh, the running theory for Zipper is their upper body head is a real head. The lower half and suit is some multi-armed demon creature that uh, that oozes something. Probably egg. So it's just... No. It's not even that. It's just like an egg golem. It's just an egg golem with a, with a bunny head. I don't know why you're singing right there, but it's adorable. Yeah, I'm doing it again right now. I need one more stupid egg. I need the sky egg. Just gonna keep giving you leaf eggs. I don't know why you keep asking. Yes. Free me from this discussion! Okay, I'm free. Free, run away, run away, run away, run away, run away, run away, run, 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 run. There's another sky egg above me. Just to torment me. Okay, so we make this. Okay, and since there was space for that, that means I know for sure there's gonna be space for making the last thing. For making Wait. No, this one. Okay. It's like, what? You picture a kid-friendly uh, meathead in a bunny suit? Eggs just squeeze out of his neck hole under the suit's head. Ah! Everything about that sentence was not okay. Everything about that sentence was profoundly not okay. Oh, so many pretty butterflies. And the one honeybee. Okay, Zipper, I have done thine evil deeds. That look on your face is it all. Did you really complete my tasks, both big and small? You crafted the wobbling zim zipper? Zipper? Zipper. Zipper, too? Yippee yahoo, I knew I could count on you. <laughs> and I promise I didn't forget my promise. Congrats, here's your super spectacular prize. Oh my god, it's another DIY recipe. It's a wonderful recipe for a bunny day wand. What do you mean, just another recipe? Sheesh, looking for a little gratitude here. After all, this excellent crafting, I think one more bunny day cheer is in order. Are you ready? You're the winner. Yes, you are. Congratulations, you're a star. Hippity hop, the fun doesn't have to stop. Bunny day festivities will continue until morale improves all day today. So go have a good hopping good time. Thanks for jumping in on my fun bunny day festivities. You've made me the hippity happiest bunny of all. What do the wands even do? I have not managed to make any of them. Because all of the other ones that I have require elements that I've... Look, I've never done the wishing stuff. So I've never gained any of the... The... The wish stars or whatever the hell they are. And of course this needs it too. Yep. We need to use the wobbling zipper toy and a star fragment to make the bunny day wand. Yeah, I have no star fragments. But no, he's not going to fuck off because he has to hang out all day. He has to be here all day. Because it is bunny day. And where else would he go? 
Pretty sure they're an outfit change menu. That seems silly, but okay. No, nope, damn it. Ah, that was worth a bunch of money. There's an orchid mantis there that I just accidentally scared away. You are a very large fish for that pond. I swear to God, if you were a fucking egg, I'm going to be really annoyed. Demon fish, come here. Stop turning away as I threw the line, you asshole. This fish is mean. Wow. Fish, come on! No, I can't throw a line there. No! God! This bamboo is in the worst spot that I could have put it. Just ignoring all of the... Well, I'm ignoring them because I don't have a slingshot anymore, but whatever. Come on, fish. Yes. You know, just scare the fucking crap out of... Oh my god. Of course, the first thing we fish up is a fucking tire. Hang on. Now that I know how to get, uh... Flies, I'm just gonna leave that tire there forever now. One. Never mind. For some reason, I always count just because the way that those things work is that, or the way that fish work is that if they get up to a count of five, or if, if you count four, like, nibbles before they've bit, then you know for sure that the next one is definitely going to be a bite. I don't know why that's a thing that I count. It's just always been something that I count. Nope, not going to do it. Thought about it, thought about it real hard, and then went, nope, I'm not going to dab. I am not going to dab. I will resist the siren call. No worries, Odin son. Honestly, I I I think we're we're gonna call it soon because this was just supposed to be a silly early morning thing of like, hey, it's Sunday and I promised a stream, and I forgot that it's Sunday, so therefore stock day and also bunny day, which I misread as egg day because I'm a fool. Yes, give give more dabs. Give more dabs. Now then, time to sell all this crap. But yeah, I think this is where we're gonna call it, just because, like I said, it was the plan was to do a silly Sunday morning thing, because I've been gone for two days. Because the plan is still to stream something tonight. Uh, Odinson, if you're up for it, still hopefully hunt, or something else if it... if something comes to mind. Um, but yeah. Honestly, like... This was mostly just supposed to be a nice, relaxing thing to get back into the, the spirit of streaming. <sighs> As I stretch out in weird ways. Um, especially because I personally am going to also have, like, a weird Easter thing with family over Zoom, which I'm expecting to probably go weirdly. We'll see. Um, also, because I just want to do more morning streams anyway, because I'm usually awake, so I might as well do them. Um, but yeah, uh, just a warning before I cut over to the, the end screen and such, we are going to be throwing to Joe Kim because I think he's the only one who I, yeah, he's basically the only person I follow, who, uh, Ed, well, he's the only person who I follow who is live now and who I would like to throw to, so, um, but the warning there is that he is playing the Final Fantasy VII Remake, so if you do not want to be spoiled probably don't go along on the raid because he's very ne he's near what he thinks is the end but we'll see um but yeah thank you all so very much for joining me uh special thank yous to alfcat trimmer 101 and dracus for supporting the stream 
uh, over on Patreon. That's patreon.com slash lore. You can find everything that we do over there or at lairoflore.com. You can also find all of the VOD recordings over at youtube.com slash lore. I need to get slightly caught up on those, but they're all there. They just might not be public yet. Um, and you can find us over at Twitter at Lair of Lore. But yeah, thank you all so very much for joining me. Uh, special thank you as well to Meandering Masquerade for that new follow during the stream. And yeah, go say hi to Joe. Uh, if you have our emotes, please throw up those those very silly high friend stream cars. If not, just shout hi friends. But yeah, I'll see you all again very soon, I hope. Bye, folks.